We're here at Thursday training with the manager, Paul Doswell. Paul, how do you feel uh, the club's done at the moment? It's been a difficult couple of weeks. Um, how do you think we're going to push on from here? Yeah, I think um, if you look at where we were uh, before, the, say, the last four games, I thought we were in a good position. Um, what the last four games has shown us is how competitive you know this league is. And also, you know, we've suffered with injury suspensions and uh, we've relied very much on the young players uh, almost since I've been here. So, yeah, we've, uh, we've got to have a close look at it now. Um, we're right in uh, the dogfight. We understand that. Um, we're going to look to bring in two or three players in the next week uh, to strengthen us, uh, to make sure that we can give it our best shot to stay in this league. It's important as a club that we do. Uh, having worked so hard, you know, last season to get in the league, um, and competing so well this year, uh, it's important that we compete for the, the last 10 games, which by the way, is still a quarter of the season. So we're in the dogfight, but we've got to make sure that we're bang up for every game. And as you said, there are a few injuries and suspensions playing a, a role here and, and another red card last time out, but how do you think bringing in a few new players, if we can, will help the team going forward? I think the team does need help. You know, it needs quality. And uh, part of what we've been trying to do this last week and certainly for the next following week we haven't got a game Saturday so we've got another 10 days to keep working away but ultimately if we can get the two or three players that we're talking to um, you know we've already secured one of those in Billy Stedman um, you know I know you've already interviewed uh, Billy tonight but a player with great technical ability uh, got a little bit about him as well and you know we nearly got him uh, two or three months ago but again the patience of having to wait but now we're in a position, you know, with 10 games to go, that getting someone in like Stepan, we're, we're very solid as a team. You know, defensively, we've been sound, but I think going forward, we need we need help. And I think Billy's going to add to that. Um, we're looking at a winger as well, to bring a winger in, um, who's probably got pace. And, you know, we're looking at bringing in another, another striker. So I think the young lads have done unbelievably well for us this year. You know, we've had seven people, seven of them, 17, 18, 19 years of age. And probably, you know, it's a tough league. To, you know, I think they maybe have hit, not all of them, but some of them have hit a bit of a wall. And we just need a bit of help. They need a bit of help between now and the end of the season. And with that 10-day period between the next game and now coming up, you just mentioned, uh, how do you think that's going to be important in getting our, our momentum back and our morale back at the club? Yeah, I think one of the biggest, uh, the biggest things that we haven't been able to do, uh, mainly because of the weather, is train. Um, and therefore, the principles of what Ross White and Andy Darton uh, you know, want to get into the players we've not been able to achieve. Um, literally every time we, we seem to come, it's, it's underwater. So I don't think it's helped playing once every two weeks. We haven't been able to get any momentum uh, during that time. But the next four training sessions, we've got obviously tonight, we've got Saturday, next Tuesday and Thursday. Those four sessions are going to be very much spent trying to get our principles back again and obviously introducing the new signings into the group. Brilliant, Paul. Thanks for your time. Thank you, Max. All right, Billy, warm welcome to Showlink. Uh, just speaking to the manager a minute ago, mentioning about making a few signings. Being the first one of those, how do you feel coming into the team? No, I'm happy. I'm happy to come. Obviously, been speaking to the gaffer for a while now. Uh, happy to get over the line at last. And uh, the last couple of games have been a bit difficult for Showlink, but just coming into the team, what do you think you can provide and uh, how do you think you can help go forward? Well, hopefully, I'll bring goals and assists and do what the goal is stay up and help the team to get three points each game. Uh, and just for the fans who don't know you, do you want to just sort of talk about what sort of player you are and what they can expect from you in the team? Uh, I'm quite a creative player. Um, I like to take risk. I'm um, tricky and I've got a good footballing brain. And uh, you've been at a few clubs before you came here. Um, where have you been over the last sort of year or so? I was out in the Irish Premier League. Uh, I was out there for two seasons and then at the start of this season I signed up having it more Louisville. Brilliant. And uh, do you think the the experience you've gained from those two clubs is going to transfer over and, and help out Shona. Oh yeah, definitely. I've been in this situation before, and um, yeah, I think I've got enough experience to bring to bring good things to the team. Brilliant, Billy. Thank you.